A new possible treatment for COVID-19 is being studied here in Arizona. Two drugs are being tested in the clinical trial in the Valley Hospitals right now. Team 12's Colleen Sakura is showing us how researchers believe this combination could help those experiencing some of the worst symptoms of the virus. This treatment would be for people who are staying in a hospital for an extended period of time or intubated and on a ventilator. It's one of many options being studied across the country. As we've watched COVID-19 spread across the United States, it's posed a challenge. It's not reacting to everybody the same way. To try and help find an option, scientists with Honor Health Research Institute and TGen are studying how atovaquone, an anti-malarial drug, and azithromycin, an antibiotic, affect COVID-19. Combination is currently used to treat an infection spread by ticks called babesiosis. It's relatively safe. I mean, no drug is 100% safe, no combination is 100% safe ever, but relatively safe. The clinical trial will enroll 25 patients across three Honor Health hospitals with moderate to severe forms of coronavirus, with the hope these two drugs will help shorten the virus and lessen the severity of symptoms. And TGen will be tracking how the virus is behaving and changing in participants. For us to be able to overcome this infection, it's not a matter of weathering the storm. It's a matter of creating a process to understand and anticipate when the next storm is coming. The trial is one of many options being looked into. On Friday, the FDA announced they approved remdesivir for emergency use as a treatment for those with severe forms of COVID-19. The antiviral drug was shown in clinical trials to reduce recovery time from the virus. And an NIH database shows more than 100 clinical trials are underway across the country for various drugs and other interventions to help address the virus. We can't hope that we're going to find a, a magic bullet. But the researchers are hopeful. Their combination of atovaquone and azithromycin will make a difference. With innovation uh, like this, we are going to find bullets and these can be used and we need to to use them um, until we are able to get a, uh, an effective vaccine in place. So far, one patient is enrolled in the trial. The scientists say while she's been on the regimen for a few days, it's too early to tell whether it's helping or not. In Phoenix, Colleen Sakura, 12 News.